Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we will try to see how to send the props to the other component using Composition API. Now, if you try to see here, so we have only one component. Now, let's try to create another component. And in that component, I will try to place this all the code. Okay, now here, let's create new file, user details. I am creating the same name or otherwise user data. Okay user data dot view i have created a new component user data dot view now in this one i will create template and in this template what i will try to do is i will try to create div and here i will script there will be script and in this one export default so this is the code right now let's try to copy this now let's try to copy this all code and place it here in the div now i have copied the all user details code and i have placed it here now what I want to do is I want to send the data. Now here uh, just I will write name, name and age, age. Okay. And I will comment out it here. Now first let's try to add the component. So how we can add the component is so now let's import the component here. Import user data from slash components slash user data. I can import like this dot view. So this is the component how we have inserted now in this one how we need to insert it is here let's add the component section same like previously how you have inserted like this only we can insert so user data now here what i will try to do, i will remove this all code and i will write user data okay now i need to send this user details so user details is exposed to the template and here i can write something like user hyphen details okay user hyphen details is equal to user details i have written like this now in this user data we need to capture here how we can capture using the props as we already know using the props so here i can write user details okay and i can write something like required true as you uh, so what you will be having the setup setup will be there in the composition api in this setup if you want to access this props how can you access we cannot access previously we will be accessing using this dot user details right as i already told you that this doesn't work in the setup so how we can access this user details so now here what it will happen is so setup provides an argument and parameter that is props props will be sent through the setup now here what i can do is let's try to print the props dot user details okay I have printed the props dot user details and let's open the output and if i open this output i am able to see that name name age age i am able to see and here in the console if i try to see here is the proxy and here is the data what it is trying to send so that means we are successfully able to send the data if i didn't write this props thing okay now if i try to check the data here See now you are getting undefined. If I try to refresh this one, now you are getting undefined. So that means with the composition API also you need to mention the props. If you mention the props only, these props, whatever the props is uh, uh, written here, these will be sent as an argument. Okay. Now I want to use these props. So now if you want to use these props, you can directly use this directly here. Okay. So how can I use this here? How, how can I use this one? So the same scenario how you will be using the uh, props we have mentioned right here i can write user details dot name okay as this one is a props we can directly access access directly so user details dot age now we need to get the output here if i try to get the output what it is saying props is defined never used okay fine so we have now never used it so we can remove this one and if i try to see the output here if i remove, close this one lila and 30 so we so this one we have successfully sent through the props now i will enable this button so that means what i am trying to do i am trying to change the name here so change the name means i am trying to change the user details dot name so how we can change so we already know that so now i will implement the change name it is a function okay so now function change name so i, I need to change the user details dot name right so now i need i will get the props and in this props what i will try to do props dot user details dot name is equal to something modified okay so i will change it like this 
and now what I need to do I need to return this change name so that it will be reflect uh, so that we can use this method in the template now if I try to say here it is saying that unexpected mutation of the user details so that means in the same scenario how, how in the options API we are unable to change the props details here in the composition API also we cannot change this props details so then now if I want to change this prop details how we can use now here you can change something like <coughs> What we can use is here in the same same something like what we can use is if you want to use computed you can use the computed or otherwise we can use directly constant okay user is equal to reactive of props dot user details okay so now here in this one I will change this user user dot name is equal to like this and I can use this change name comma user I can send this user instead of using this user details I need to use the user ok so I have used this user now if I try to uh, go here reactive is not defined ok we need to import that reactive thing so if I click here reactive we need to import reactive from view and here if I try to refresh this one ok I, I got the Leland here and if I click here see modified Lila has been successfully changed so this is how we can change the props so when we get the props we cannot directly mutate change the props data so we can use it like this okay so this is how we can uh, now if you want to use this computed also you can use for example i want to use full details if you want to use if you want to use the full details how how we can use so if you want to use uh, the computer property how we can use this here i will write something like full details okay so i will be having full details or something like this okay so i will be showing full details and here i can write something like constant full details is equal to computed okay so it could be method and in that return and in that return method now here we can return So return user dot name plus sorry age plus user dot age we can also use like this now if you try to see here full details we are showing right so now the computer property we need to send it there and here I can send it automatically and if you try to see here computed is not defined again we need to compute it so these things will be so now we need to import it the computed also now if you try to check the output here if I try to refresh I am able to see if I click here see uh, automatically here also it has been changed ok so this is how we will be using the props in the composition API so in this way we need to use the props in the composition API if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you